Hello everybody. Um, I know I haven't been here for a while and I apologize, but I wanted to come back um, and kind of talk to you a little bit about how to save some money when you are looking at the new metallic um, lips that are out right now. I know ColourPop has them, Jeffree Star has them, everybody has them. So um, I wanted to really talk to you about how you can get the same kind of look on a budget. Um, you can really go anywhere. I know that I got this pigment right here by LA Color. Um, it's in the shade Honeysuckle. And um, Jessie's Girl here also has a bunch of these. So you can make any color metallic that you want, really. And um, this is their eye dust. Now you can also use this on the lips. I actually used it a little bit on the um, apples on my cheeks today. You can't really see because of my lighting for a, a highlight. Um, you can really use it any way that you want. Um, and I, it doesn't really say what color it is, but it's a really pretty, like a rose gold type of color. I love using this on my eyes and everything like that. So there's also a white shimmer in this same one um, that I don't have anymore, but it's there and it's pretty cool. So is you can take any lip color that you like or that you want. Um, and I actually have a bunch swatched on my arm. There's going to be pictures included into the video um, of each of these colors. Um, but basically you put it, you take it, you put on your lips like normal, the lipstick, and then you just pat it on. Now you can do as much or as little as you want depending on the metallic that you want. I actually did a little bit today. It's nowhere near metallic. It just has a little bit of a sheen. Um, I'm actually going to show you the um, combination that I have on today. The lip is called Wet n Wild. It's the Mega Last color. Um, again, it does not have a name or anything, but this is the packaging. And I put a little bit of the Jessie's Girl right over top. And really, it gives you a nice little sheen. I'm going to go ahead and insert the pictures of the main swatches. And then right after that, I'm going to insert the swatch of the Jessie's Girl right on top. Um, and this is so, so pretty. This can make anything look either iridescent or um, very metallic. It's up to you. So I'm going to go ahead and include this now. Right now, we do have to talk about the um, eyeshadow with the brush, the Shimmering Loose Eyeshadow um, from LA Colors. It will hog up the color more. Um, if you, this one, what I mean by that is if you really want it more metallic, that's the way you want to go. If you want more of a shimmer, then you want more of the Jessie's Girl. That gives you more colors. Um, that you can choose from and also it has a, a bigger pigment or a, a bigger um, grain so that it'll show more of your color through and again I'll include some of the swatches so that you can be able to see what it really looks like and um, yeah before we move on to the next one I will say on the darker colors as you can see you would want to use a silver or maybe even a white sh um, shimmer. I do know that this comes in white, pink, gold, um, and I think a clear version. So you would really want to get something like this instead. This just opens up like this. It has its own little brush um, and a little hole in there. You can dip your own brush in there um, when this other one just has a sifter. That really doesn't matter all that much, but as you can see in the swatches, it would be better to use a lighter color on the darker colored lips just so that you don't get any, you know, covering of the actual color. But on these lighter pinks, they're actually beautiful, and you really want to use those, especially if you're new to the whole lipstick sort of thing, if you're new to metallics, or if you want to start to, um, 
explore into the more uh, fun colors. You can do anything on top of anything, really. And the good thing about today, um, today's society, really, is that nothing is really, you know, judged upon when it comes to makeup because of the drag queen era and everything like that. So, yeah, that is pretty cool. And it's also fun mixing colors. Now, please excuse my messy work desk, but this is the third and final. This is actually going to be my mixing thing here. If you want more of metallic, but you um, don't want a lot of other color, you want it to be maybe more sheer, depending on the um, color that you use, the pigment that you put into it, you can take a lip gloss and just put a little bit of pigment in and mix it and it will make that beautiful metallic pigment however color you want. So we'll go ahead and mix that now. Now this one does have a little bit of pink in it, but that shouldn't matter because the color that I'm gonna put in is going to be pink anyway. to take my Jessie's girl right there okay so then you can go ahead and just pour a little bit of this pigment in here like this that was actually too much set it off to the side and then mix this right on in And as you can see, it's already starting to get that beautiful sheen to it. Now, I chose to use the silicone because it's easier to clean. And it, um, if you wanted to take it and put it right onto your lips from here, um, it would be easier to apply. Now, this is already flavored, so I mean, you wouldn't taste anything nasty. So... There is a little swatch here for you on here, and I'm going to go ahead and put one on my hand for you. You can see now you have a beautiful little sheen, but you don't have all of the, you know, strongness of a full lipstick. now because this is such a pretty pretty color and it would match what I have on so I'm just going to take my little silicone little spreader here take a little bit I have a little thing here and this looks just beautiful you see already how that just looks metallic and you don't even really I probably this would save you so much money and you could customize it the way you want so in, and you could customize it the way you want so in case you couldn't find that green metallic lipstick that you were looking for or it sold out you can make it yourself much cheaper Let me go ahead and adjust my camera so that you can see it better. Now you can use this for lips, eyes, and that would be beautiful anywhere. Alright, and that's it for today, guys. Um, if you'd like to see more, definitely let me know. Thank you so much for watching. Hit the subscribe button if you like it. I'm going to try to make more videos um, regularly. <coughs> so... Yeah, thank you so much for watching, and I will...